Hello dear friends, welcome to Dental Education Hub YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss about the zinc polycarboxylate dental cement. In this session, what we are going to cover, we will study uh, the brief introduction of the zinc polycarboxylate cement, also known as polycarboxylate dental cement. Uh, we will study the dispensing form uh, and the composition of this cement. We will study the setting reaction of the dental cement and we will also study the uses of the polycarboxylate dental cement. So watch this video till the end. So the, the polycarboxylate dental cement is the first dental cement that exhibit a bonding, chemical bonding to the tooth structure. Previous dental cements such as zinc oxide eugenol cement or the zinc phosphate cement, they form mechanical bond with the tooth structure. This cement is biocompatible. It means cements show less adverse reactions as compared to the previous dental cements such as zinc phosphate dental cement. So the dispensing and composition like in which forms this cement is available and, and what is the chemical composition of this cement. So the cement is available in uh, powder and liquid formulations usually. The composition include uh, the powder of the cement. It includes zinc oxide, which is the main key ingredient of the, of the dental cement with some amount of magnesia, tin oxide, bismuth oxide, and or aluminum. The liquid component is aqueous solution of polyacrylic acid or copolymer of acrylic acid. The cement uh, set by an acid-based reaction and what happens, the zinc oxide that is present in the powder, it reacts with the polycarboxylic acid that is present in the liquid. And it forms a cement matrix in which the polyacid chains, they are cross-linked with the zinc ions. This cement is less acidic uh, if you compare the cement with the previous uh, dental cement such as zinc phosphate cement. So it is less acidic uh, and therefore it is less injurious to the dental pulp as compared to the zinc phosphate cement which was more acidic. Now what are the clinical applications or what are the uses of the polycarboxylate dental cement? So the clinical applications of the polycarboxylate cement, it, in, it is used for cementation of crowns, bridges, and inlays. Beside this, the zinc polycarboxylate uh, dental cement, it is also used as a cavity-based material under metallic restorations such as dental amalgam. However, in very deep cavities, uh, instead of polycarboxylate cement, uh, a sublining of calcium hydroxide cement is used. This cement is also sometimes used for a cementation of orthodontic bands. But now, the glass ionomer cement is more widely used for cementation of orthodontic bands, but it is one of the use of the polycarboxylate cement, cementation of orthodontic bands. Now, there are some modifications in the polycarboxylate cement. The polycarboxylate cement do not have any therapeutic or preventive properties like uh, zinc oxide eugenol cement which, in which the eugenol has therapeutic potential on the dental pulp uh, or in case of the glass ionomer cement which releases fluoride. So there are some modifications that are done in the polycarboxylate cement. For example, some recently developed products, they contain fluoride salts such as stannous fluoride, which may exert some anti-cariogenic effect by the release of fluoride. But the fluoride release is very low in these products as compared to the original glass ionomer dental cements. Thank you very much for watching this uh, short lecture. Please uh, do give us your feedback in the comments and stay blessed.